How are you doing folks? Right, this is just a little uh, a little uh, video. I just wanted to say a big thank you to everyone who's bought any merchandise or even just subscribing to the channel. Um, just subscribing and, and watching the crappy ads what come up, you know, helps me generate a little bit of money. And as you know from this group, all that money is getting ploughed back into Search and Rescue. Uh, all the equipment and bits I need. So, um, some people have already seen this and I think I've mentioned it maybe in a video or it's one to come out. But uh, I got my first month's commission money from um, clothing and bits from the merchandise. Um, which is, if you go to the link in the bio and stuff in the description, it will show you on there. There's all sorts of other stuff. If you don't see anything there, email them and they'll sort you out. Um, but you can have anything, any type of clothing, any you know, you, all sorts. But yeah, I get a little bit out of each item that's sold. And just be all up and honest and up front with you all, I made £27 this month, which is <laughs> 27 quid. Uh, I don't have to touch any of it. I don't ship it. I don't do anything. I just let, just let you get a cut. So it works brilliant for me. I don't have any mess arounds, you know. So, and I, so I thought I will show you what I spent my 27 quid on. So, good old eBay. So, got myself a search and rescue hat. Uh, that was about tenner, I think £10.50. And then uh, one of the first things we needed uh, well, was one of these, don't know if you know what they are, but they're throw lines. So, I have this in the rucksack. This is a big 25 metre one. So the idea is you hold this handle and you basically can throw the whole bag and it will go for you know 20 half metres and there's a handle on the end. So you can pull people in if they're in a river or anything like that in ponds. This is all sort of the little bits of equipment I need to sort of stop my rucksack up with. Just little bits where we don't know where you know a situa situation is going to come in. Like my last search and rescue was searching all the rivers because the, the guy involved... Had a, had a history of trying to drown himself and um, he had tried to commit suicide once before so obviously things like this and obviously Lincolnshire is quite a lot of water well there is all around the UK to be honest lots of reservoirs all sorts so always handy to have my rucksack and then um, so yeah so that's uh, 16.95 so basically there's me 27 quid um, so that's what you lot have bought and I just want to say thank you, you know, this is, you know, just helped save me. I mean, I know I, I work, and I, you know, but obviously with the kids and everything else, it, it's still a struggle for me. So any help through YouTube to help support, you know, this, buying all these, you know, little bits and bobs, um, it's just amazing. And, you know, and it, to you guys, it's just going towards, you know, me helping somebody. Um, the other thing I've just bought, I've just treated myself. Um, I've just been into my local millets in Louth and a massive thank you. I did ask them a while ago. Uh, they know I work with Elcat and I have a, I don't know if you've seen these. These are, uh, they're basically a blue light card. It's for all like emergency services, NHS, I think NHS and stuff have these. But um, you know, fire brigade, police, um, you have to be a registered emergency charity. Which gives you a discount. So, just being in, I needed boots, um, and I was looking at some Peter Storm ones, and they had none in my size. But I've just got a new ones in. So, this is out of YouTube's money, basically. Uh, well, I've topped it up. So, I mean, the YouTube, I, um, uh, I don't know, average is about 50 quid a month 70 quid a month no it's all about 70 pounds i would say maximum a month um so sometimes it takes two months because it, it's it, it pays out after you get 60 after you've got 60 pound then it'll pay you out so anything you earn over that amount over in a month it'll pay so if i earn 300 quid it'll, it'll pay me you know straight away at the end of the month if i don't earn the 60 pound it'll carry on over to the next month and then it'll pay me a double one. So it's not every month you're getting money. So, but as I say, every little bit of that helps. So yeah, this is what I bought. Uh, these were 70 quid. I don't own a pair. I do actually own a pair of boots. And um, they're like a canvas ones. I can't get me foot in them. They're 11s, but they're so tight and they hurt. 
so they're going in a car boot so so i've got loads of stuff to do a car boot with next year so yeah they're all full leather um inside and out full waterproof and with my commission and um, with the blue card they knocked it down to 59 pound 50. so then you can see that it might be all backwards about me but yeah that's brilliant um i mean they don't advertise the fact they can do discount but without even me mentioning i had a blue card um they already told me a few weeks ago i was looking at rucksacks there that they'll come back in we'll sort you out with some discount so yeah there you go guys that's the start off um also i'm just trying to get my jacket sorted i've emailed the company who do all my cl all the clothing lines um G4H, I think they call it, yep. Yeah. Uh, he obviously works with our LCAP group. I've emailed him and messaged him to see what size and stuff he's got. I'm buying that out of personal money at the moment, but I'll just top it back up. Um, I've sold my metal detector, my big one, uh, just to help fund all this, because I, I need some winter clothes. Winter's coming fast. So that's the idea of the hat, the boots, and I need a coat, um, and obviously they do these, they're quite expensive ones, they're like a three layer uh, coat, so you can strip off different layers, um, depending on the temperature, which is really good, but obviously it comes all logoed up all over the back, the arms, everything, so uh, I know online they're £85, but we do get a discount with um, with them, so I'm just what I'm just waiting for, so yeah. I mean, you know, that was the main thing I needed. I, I did leave the rucksack. They had, did have some nice rucksacks in. Um, I'm still not 100% sure what size I need. Keep looking at them. They've only got a 28 litre and a 55 litre, the ones I like. Uh, the ones I like, it's got like a metal frame on the back. So it keeps the rucksack away from your back. So, because I, obviously a big lad, <laughs> sweat a lot. So, and I know my mountain bike bag it's got this mesh bit on the back and it's brilliant it keeps you lovely and cool so yeah because when we're on our search and rescue we could be walking miles um you know in all terrain so yeah i needed boots i definitely needed boots so bought them with my metal detector money so but yeah um slowly getting there with it all so yeah this video was just basically dedicated to you guys um, without you guys you know a lot of this wouldn't uh, help and it also inspires me a bit more as well so because obviously I get a little bit of money help it sort of inspires me to get these bits and get out and I want to you know get, well not I don't really want to use them I don't want to be saving anyone with this I just want to have it in my bag that's what we all want but as we know um, you know things happen I've got kids as well we don't know falling in a pond or something I might need it for them so that's about it guys just a big thank you if you've not already subscribed please like and subscribe it doesn't cost you anything at all if the numbers get up obviously then my YouTube videos get out further um, it's all the stupid algorithms I don't pay attention to them but you know the channel is going really good um, you know, compared to my videos, the crap. I know the crap, guys. You know, I, I, I'm, I keep saying I'm going to start trying to do a bit better, but it's not lazy. It's just I just don't find the time for the editing. I just like a raw. It's easy for me to do like a raw, natural video. I don't edit anything. Everything you see is recorded, and it just basically I just press click on my phone like that, all the way on all the videos, and it uploads it, and then it just. The, the 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 you know the software I use just blends them all in, so <coughs> it, it's just so handy you know. So you get more of a real life, and that's what I wanted for my kids because this whole channel was about you know what we do with the kids, and also it's branched out a bit now you know with obviously Millie, um, so you guys can see you know where we get up to with Millie and get inspiration. You know you don't have to have a van. I mean. I noticed now it's really big for cars. Uh, I watch loads on TikToks, loads of car people, you know, traveling and living it. Well, not living full time in a car, but, you know, traveling in cars. 
so yeah so i'm really chuffed now so i know we've got night training coming up any week now so hopefully get my coat i'll get you that shown but yeah i think that's about it that's a lot for now that's just a quick thank you and we will see you again next one is this saturday will be part two of the airland show it's more the first one i did i had massives i had about an hour and an hour and a half in videos in the end and it was like god so the first one was all music the second one i know it's a bit long still you can skip through but yeah it's a bit of a more of a walk around everywhere um you know all around the campus and stuff but there's there's no music really in it. it's just more chatting and stuff like that so hope you enjoy and i think i'm a couple of videos ahead now a few weeks ahead so this is why this is getting uploaded today this is thursday so it's literally i'm filming it i'm going to upload it and then saturday will be out as a fill-in because i don't want to be getting too far ahead of myself uh, i've still got the quarry one which is out and as uh where else have i got i think that's it yeah yeah so i'm a good week ahead now so it gives me a, a week leeway if we have a crap week so yeah i'm just basically parked up in my town stealth camping in the street again outside my mum's i'm doing decorating so i've got to wait for my kids to pick them up tomorrow but yeah we're going to be on holiday oh also before i go uh, me and Mini Off Grid will be on holiday. We don't know where to go yet. If anyone's got any ideas, I fancy a meet up somewhere. If any other van life or lorry lifers might end up Derbyshire way. But anyone met into mountain biking, I need to get out on my bike. Got to get out on it. Uh, my little one's going to bring his bike as well. Um, so I fancy it in some sort of bike trails or something like that. But I don't know where they all are. So hook me up if you're into mountain bikes or maybe want to meet up. Um, yeah, I'm still unsure where to go yet. I don't know where to go, like Yorkshire, Derby Forest, is it? Or Sherwood Pines, or up into the Peak District. But yeah, I've got a week off. From the, I think it's from the 15th I've got it off, yeah. But it's school holidays, so I'm both my lads. The oldest one I've got having at the end of the week, because he's still at school for the first week. So they're, they're both on different times. So yeah, that's enough, guys. Me waffling on massive thank you to all again as i said much appreciated i know it's horrible watching all these shitty little you know adverts and stuff but google's making money out of it so why don't we and it's going to a good cause that's the way i look at it so you know anything i can get helps towards and it's not like this e-begging where everyone's a bit upset about you know it is going to a charity so you know I'll leave it at that. So, right, I'm going to start and get some tea on the go. Right, thanks a lot, guys. See you next week.